Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it seems that Microsoft is giving the PhoneLink app quite a lot of attention of late. And first of all, that's because earlier today I posted a video that the Microsoft PhoneLink app uh, will soon let you extract text from images using optical character recognition technology. A very similar feature to what we currently get uh, in the snipping tool for Windows 11. And I'll leave that video in the end screen if you'd like to go check that out. And now the second uh, is because in last week's latest beta channel inside a preview build, it seems now that Microsoft is working on another feature that's going to make it easier for you to share files using the phone link app on Windows 11. Now this a small but yet I think a significant change if you are using the phone link app was once again spotted by Phantom of Earth over on X. So if we head to an image provided, this will give us a good idea. So here we can see a new phone button uh, to share your content to your Android and iOS phones when you click on the nearby share section. Now just to break this down um, a little bit, because obviously this isn't the most exciting feature to write home about, so to speak, but if you are using the phone link app, obviously this could be, as mentioned, quite a significant change. And uh, um, previously, you needed to click the phone link app option uh, in the share window to send a file, which was here next to the other apps um, share using. Now, this is where this all changes, as we can see, where the phone option now is directly um, in the actual nearby share section, which is a separate action um, now altogether, completely separate from the other apps. So obviously, Microsoft now pushing the use of the phone link app. As mentioned, they are giving this quite a lot of attention of late. And uh, it also shows here to the right hand side a prompt to turn on um, nearby sharing. But um, this can be a little bit confusing. So you don't actually need to enable nearby sharing first to use the my phone, the phone link option. So that could be a little bit confusing, but nonetheless. And then obviously um, you just then send the file clicking on my phone and you only need then to click on the my phone option to send the file you don't have to turn on nearby sharing but they're just giving this option obviously as a quick shortcut if you would like to turn on nearby sharing so there we go that's um, two little features as mentioned I posted earlier today that video will be in the end screen and now this uh, uh, sharing button now that's um, exclusive now to the uh, my phone link app that's going to make it a lot easier to be able to send your files uh, when this does make its way down to the stable version. And it's in beta now currently, so um, I would suggest because it's in beta, we could see this in a couple of weeks. Um, if we don't, then I'm sure this will be something we see with 24H2 later this year, but I think we'd see this before the, the annual feature update. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.